a very short puppet show starting right here in one minute. Um, facing that way. <laughs> In the presence of pine trees and also pine needles and also pine cones <laughs> and a cloudy sky and an arriving audience, I present to you the picture of a man and also his robe. The man in the picture is framed, is wearing a light blue shirt, is leaning on a table, is wearing a mustache in the style of someone who is trying to look older than they actually are, and is being watched over by a houseplant. <laughs> the robe is long, red, tattered, and made out of terry cloth, an oddly comfortable version of plastic. <laughs> and now I will perform for you the battle between the picture of the man and the rope. First, in a blatant show of vulnerability, the robe embraces itself. The man in the picture responds by smiling. <laughs> the robe decides to invoke the power of gravity. But the man continues to smile. <laughs> the robe then decides to invoke its own version of lightness and flutters in the wind. And the man continues to smile. The robe recognizes it needs to change its tactics and begins to outmaneuver the man. <laughs> to the left. <laughs> To the right. <laughs> it confuses him. It distracts him. And then, when the man is looking the other way, <laughs> still smiling. <laughs> At the last resort, with no other option. <laughs> the robe remembers that it still has one trick up its sleeve. <laughs> A note. <laughs> Tell him I will outlive him. <laughs> Is it possible that this man, even when faced with his own mortality, continues to smile? <laughs> well, thankfully, this picture frame is equipped with a state-of-the-art picture communication device. <laughs> I will ask him. <laughs>
Thank you. <laughs>